Hello everyone and welcome back once again. So everyone probably knows that the shadows in X-Plane kind of suck. Anyways, there is this add-on that basically remakes all the shadows and adds more of them. It also just makes them look much better in general and this actually did take me by surprise because I did not really think shadows would make a large difference in the game. Then you would think it would take some frames away, but for me I was gaining frames by about 1 or 2. I'm not really sure if that's just a coincidence or not, but anyways, let us go and hop into x 11 without this add-on and see how it looks. Okay, so here is x with default shadows. Now, I mean, they look okay, I guess, but like, they can, they can be so much better. They have a lot of room for improvement is what I'm trying to say. Anyways, guys, let's go ahead and real quickly load up xplain.org. Alrighty, guys, so here is where you guys will be downloading the add-on. It is called Asha. I will link this down below in the description. Anyways, guys, before we do download this, this is a Lua script, which does require Fly with Lua, which I will also link down below in the description. Anyways, guys, let's real quickly go ahead and download this, and it is pretty small, so it should not take long. We can go ahead and minimize our browser. And now, guys, as always, we can go ahead and take this drag it right out onto our desktop and now we do not need this anymore we can go ahead and go into our explain 11 folder we can go ahead and go to resources and now we can go to plugins and fly with lua scripts and now guys we can go ahead and put this right in here to scripts and just like that guys the download is really that simple Okay, so x is now loaded up, and obviously there is a huge difference from before. The shadows look very bold and just more apparent. Also, the shadows no longer look super pixelated and outdated, and just generally unrealistic like before. Another cool feature is within the settings, you guys can go to a plugins, and then fly with Lua, and then fly with Lua macros, and then here we can locate to Asha settings. Once you click on that, a page will show up and there will be a variety of different resolutions you guys can choose from. Now, I personally prefer 4K because I do gain an additional 2 to 3 frames per second. Anyways, you guys can try out 8K or 16K or any other resolution. Now, I did try out 8K and 16K and I just wasn't getting any really big of a difference also it was really killing my fps anyways guys that will conclude today's short tutorial and if this did help you guys i do post videos like this almost daily so make sure you guys do have post notifications on so you do not miss a video but guys thank you very much for watching and i will catch you in the next one